What is happening, everybody? Welcome back to Dark Horse Sports Cards. You have Brody here back with another fun, exciting video. We are going to be ripping Gold Standard Hobby today. Uh, we've ripped the FOTL. A lot of fun. But uh, we're going to check out what Gold Standard is. It's a little bit cheaper. I think these actually might even still be available on Panini's website. If you guys want to go check those out. But uh, Gold Standard is what we're going to be ripping today. Seeing what is in this. There's all sorts of fun goodies in here. But before we jump into this, I got to tell you. I don't know what's going on with the Raiders. But you guys let me know how your team fared this past week. The Gardner Minshew experiment, I hope, is over in La La Land. Uh, it did look like AP made a statement saying that AOC, well, he didn't say AOC. He said, we are looking at potentially making a quarterback change. I think that obviously means they're looking at maybe starting AOC this next week against the Browns, which I also will be flying out to watch Kelsey in that. Uh, Kelsey had some great, great clips. If you guys aren't following us over on social media, make sure you follow us. Dark Horse, I think it's the Dark Horse Sports Cards on Instagram. I try to post some stuff on there, sports card-wise and football-wise with me and Kelsey uh, to not flood my main account. So if that's of interest, let me know. There's some good dancing clips. She also gave out a $750 gift card for Allegiance, which was also kind of cool. But with that being said, uh, it was a tough week, man. Tough week for a lot of teams. Getting beat by Bryce, not even Bryce Young, getting beat by Andy Dalton, making Andy Dalton the first quarterback this season. The first quarterback this season to throw 300 yards and three touchdowns in a game. I don't, I, the NFL sometimes baffling to me because we go into Baltimore and we make Lamar Jackson and Derrick Henry look puny. And then we let Andy Dalton, uh, Thielen got hurt in the first half. So they didn't even have him the whole second half. I don't know. It's embarrassing. Uh, but also the Dallas Cowboys are kind of embarrassing too. So a lot of teams are going through it right now. If you are, you feel my pain, uh, let me know your grievances in the uh, comment section down below. But we're going to be opening Gold Standard. We've ripped into some of the FOTL, which was awesome. We've also opened some of these in breaks, and they've been great. You know, this is the 2024 product, the 24, 2024 class. So we are looking for J.J. McCarthy, Penix, those guys, autos, RPAs. Uh, you can see everything on the back here. There's some pretty cool case hits as well that we're looking for. Obviously, anything one of one. And uh, they have mystery rookies. Mystery rookies. And speaking of mystery rookies, we hit a product hit. Yes. So for those that don't understand, let me explain. You have a case hit. So when Panini makes their products, they put 12 boxes, 20 boxes, depending on what it is, into a case. And then they'll send those cases out and in each case is usually one big card. We call it the case hit, right? Now, they're sitting out thousands of these cases. And out of those thousands of those cases, there are product hits. Those are the things that you're really hunting after. Those are the big, big cards. And uh, it didn't get picked up. I posted this on Instagram, so maybe you guys did see it. It didn't really get picked up by anyone else. But this is a product hit. I think this is the first time ever that uh, this card has been hit for the 2024 rookie class. This is out of select. This is the 2024 XRC Mystery Auto Black Prism. That's of 101. That means there's only five of these in existence and it's XRC Auto 1. So to me, that means it's going to be a big, big time number one. Who knows? Some people are saying it could be Patrick Mahomes. I don't think so. Some people are saying Caleb Williams. Let me know in the comments down below who you think it's going to be. I think it normally, from what I've gathered, normally they wait until the end of the season to see what the big the big rookies are, and then they get that. So to me, this is probably like J.J. McCarthy, Penix, something like that. Maybe Jaden Daniels. Obviously, some of these guys, the whole Fanatics, Tops, uh, Panini, who they're signing with, that whole ordeal. Some of these guys might not even sign with Panini, so... Let me know. Give me your best guesses what you think this is. The uh, gold, I believe, of this got pulled and sold for $7,500. So let me know also how much you think this card's worth. $10,000? $12,000? $15,000? dollars 
Let me know in the comments, but this is a massive, massive pull. And like I said, this was pulled in one of our breaks. So, uh, heck, if you want to hang out, watch some sick cards get pulled, we're going to be breaking tonight as well. So jump on over to whatnot. But uh, let's rip into this gold standard. These things are running uh, anywhere from, what, I think $400, $500 resale, depending on where you get it from. And uh, they've been pretty good. People have been liking opening this product so far. And I, I like Gold Standard. I think it's a cool looking box. The presentation I think is really nice. And the cards themselves I think are really cool as well. So uh, let's see what we have in store for us today with a little gold. And like I said, I tried to wait for Kelsey to rip this. She loves gold probably more than anyone I know. <laughs> no pun intended. Uh, but I can't wait any longer. Can't wait any longer, babe. She will be back next week. So this whole week, you guys have me here on YouTube. She will be back next week. And Silver Sage, I think, is also going to start ripping some baseball here soon. Uh, so be on the lookout for that. But we got Nate Wiggins on the front. It looks like we have a white gold, too. So we're going to have Nate Wiggins here for the Ravens wearing the protective. Now, why aren't more guys wearing this helmet? Please let me know. I mean, if, if you told me, hey, listen, this isn't going to mess up your individual performance at all. The only thing is you're going to look a little funky wearing it because no one else is. So it's going to be a little odd. But the likelihood of you getting a concussion reduces significantly. I don't understand why more people aren't wearing this. This is 30 out of 75. All right, then we're going to have another card on uh, another, one more base card, and then I think we got a white gold. Oh, here we go. Lions, Laporta, Gibbs. All right, Jameer Gibbs. This is solid. Jameer Gibbs out of 40. That's very nice. Two out of 40. Lions are looking uh, pretty solid. Getting back into form. Amon Ra doing his thing. So we will take that. We're going to sleeve that bad boy up. We will take that for sure. Little Jameer Gibbs. They're going to try to make another run this year. See what happens. Also, the Chiefs, if you guys watched the game last night, I mean, they're inevitable. Like, they, they just, I don't, I don't, I don't get it. Is this Latu? I think it's Latu. Yeah, Latu for the Colts. All right. Ooh. This is a really pretty card. 8 out of 24 on the white. Is this like the white gold? What is this? OP. I'm not sure what OP is. Um, this is a beautiful card though. Holy smokes. Very beautiful. It's not white gold or anything, but it's it's beautiful. 8 out of 24 for lot 2. Very nice. Love it, love it. I want some more of it. All right, we continue, we continue. Whoa. Oh, my gosh. What is... Okay, well, guys, this could be massive. Wow, there they are. There they are. Jaden Daniels, JJ McCarthy, Michael Penix. I haven't seen this card. This is out of 99. I have, I, this is the first time I've seen it. Beautiful card. With the three big quarterbacks, too, that are currently in this class. And, uh, I mean, J.J. looked pretty good before he got hurt. Jane Daniels is an electric factory. He's very fun to watch. So, that is uh, that might be a big card. No idea on the value of this. I'll throw the values up. Um, but, beautiful. Let me get this lighting a little bit better, too, for you guys. Sorry. I just got back in town. Flew out this morning after the game. And uh, so I apologize for that. All right. Show us auto here. Latu again. Wow. All right. Latu. How about another one? Another Latu. Any Latu lovers out there? I would have loved to have seen a little color in these patches. You know, we got five napkins here. But that's Latu out of 299. On the mother load, cool name. That's probably my favorite thing about this card. Is I think that's a cool name, mother load. Just a lot of patches there. All right. Uh, we got 
three cards left. Yeah, three cards left. Hopefully, these are all autos. You get, you have five mims or autos, but they can have like different combos. Normally, you're gonna get three mims and two autos, but hopefully, we got. Oh, we got Bryce Young. We got Bryce Young. All right, Brycey Poo. Kelsey told me that he. Uh, this actually lasts on the print too. Two ninety nine out of two ninety nine. Kelsey told me that he is very tiny. She uh, walked by him. Very, very tiny. Very tiny person. But, um, you know, watching watching Andy Dalton just carve us up, I don't think was probably the greatest thing for his uh, future. But I think, I honestly think if you give this guy a shot, maybe, maybe something turns out, you know? Maybe something turns out for him. All right. We're going to need two big autos. The big card we got was... Um, the three quarterbacks, which was nice. Got another lion. Charger. Quentin. Brendan Rice. Ooh, look at that patch though. Wow. Chargers have nice patches. Brendan Rice out of 24. This is six out of 24. Brendan Rice. Uh, I don't remember him. Is that damage there? Can't tell. Is that damage or is that just the card? That might be some damage right there. Not sure, but can't remember uh, him doing too much against doing too much against the uh, Raiders this year when we watched when I watched that game. So I'm not sure if he's a I'm not sure if he's a big name guy for them. Is there, there was already a sleeve in there. What the heck was that? All right, last card. Gonna need something here. Brendan Rice is not going to get the ladies going. I'll tell you that much right now. Gonna need something here. And another horizontal card. I'm not a huge fan of the horizontals. Justin Fields, auto, more. Oh, a Dunze. Okay, this is nice. This guy is this guy's having himself a nice little season. Uh, start of the season. Him, Malik Neighbors has been looking really good as of late. Marvin Harrison Jr., obviously. But he is one of the top rookies in this class. Roma Dunze, this is actually not too shabby. Out of 199, would have loved a little bit of a lower number. But hey, decent auto. I don't love these Sharpies that they had these guys sign in. I'm not a massive fan of like the thick Sharpies. I think a, a fine pin, a fine pin, a fine print, fine print, fine line. Whatever I'm talking about would have looked really, really clean, I think, on these cards. But there you have it. Out of 199. Rome Adunze. Very nice. All right. So gold standard. I, I like this product. It's been a fun rip. You're getting the you know RPAs of the 2024 class, hunting the big names, and um, it's been enjoyable so far. We got what Don Rest Elite coming out soon. I think National Treasure uh, FOTL just came out, but that's an eight thousand dollar box, so no way we were touching that. I can tell you that much right now. Uh, but yeah, it's been fun so far, ripping some of the product from 2024, fun so far, football season. We got eliminated in our survivor bracket, other updates. We went with the Raiders, so that was like a double punch in the gut because the two favorites, the Bucks had lost, and then the Giants ended up beating, oh man, who did they beat? Can't remember, let me know in the comments. But whoever the Giants beat, those were like the two big favorites. So I think like the pool that we were in, that were $14 million pool, there was like 30% of the people in. Like there was like no one left. So had we gotten through this week, there would have been maybe like a thousand people or so left. It would have been exciting. But you know, you live till another day. That's going to do it today, guys. Thanks so much. Make sure you drop a like down below. Make sure you're subscribed. Thank you guys for supporting the channel. And we'll see you guys in the next one. Keep ripping them packs.